labels other than those for critical safety things are awful. They have done so much damage in society. And um, I want to tell you the story of my tattoo. If I can find the photos of that, it was so cool. And we had to like give a specific time where they could work on the wall because they wanted to just do it the whole time. It was so fun. Um, here's the little man that I've been talking about and you can see him um, drawing my tattoo that I have. And this is me. I'm the tall one and that's him in the middle. He always wore green neon glasses so he drew that. And these are his three third grade buddies that he got to be really close with and do their level of academic work. He's got their details on their shirts that they wore the day that he was sketching this out. And I wanted to remember, like he, because, and this is all because too much is being put upon teachers, but he had been labeled um, as a naughty. And he was trying to tell us in his own five-year-old way what he needed and this really good teacher who was so overwhelmed didn't have time to um, pick up on that. And that's what teachers are going through. We can't do our job the way we want because we are overwhelmed. And I wanted to do the tattoo to always remember, no matter what, take the time and look at each kid individually. He was amazing and I checked on him the next year because the school, he got moved to a different school since they were um, imploding the building. And they just said he was doing okay. I, I pray and hope that his academic needs are being met. I don't know. Um, that's been three years ago. So anyway, I hope he's doing well. And never judge a kid by their behavior, they're trying to tell you something. You all know that. We just need more time to be able to figure out what they're trying to tell us and we don't have that right now.